Good morning. I'm Dr. Gary Waddell, Superintendent of Santa Clara Unified School District, and this is our district update for April 2024. We have a lot of good news to celebrate this year. I'd like to uh, share a couple of awards that will, the district will be receiving at uh, the county's Power of Democracy event that's hosted by the Santa Clara County Office of Education. First, a huge shout out goes to Wilcox student Olga Galperin, who will receive the Santa Clara County Community Champion Award. Congratulations, Olga. Also, our district as a whole will receive an honorable mention for the Civic Education Outstanding School District. I'm very proud of this recognition. We really prioritize civics education, the importance of uh, supporting our students to have voice and be active participants in our shared democracy. You know, the springtime brings a number of things, showers, flowers, but also uh, assessments. Um, we, we know that our state assessment window has already begun and will continue for some time. We encourage all of our boys and girls to see these assessments as opportunities to show what you've learned this year, to do your very best um, and really focus and give it, give it your all for these state assessments. And we know that we're gonna do just great. We have a number of things on tap for next year, uh, important things that we've been working on this year. One of those is secondary math pathways. You've heard a lot about those this year and you'll be hearing more. Those will be implemented in middle and high school next year. Also, we've had an amazing literacy work group, elementary literacy work group that selected phonics materials that um, they recommended to our board who approved them, and those will be implemented next fall as well. So we're really excited about that work. We also have an initiative that we're very enthused about called ALAS, which is Advancing Latino Achievement and Success. And this work really is about us listening to our Latino students, staff, community, to learn how we can continually do better on this uh, continuous improvement journey that we're on to provide the, the very best that we can to every student who walks through our doors at SCUSD. That work has begun this year with focus groups of students listening to their stories about what works in their schools, what we could do better, all in an effort for us giving the very best that we can to all of our boys and girls. I'll just wrap up with a reminder about our kindness campaign. You know, we have a lot of things that we focus on, a lot of things that we're working on and prioritize, and kindness is right up there with the rest of them. We know that being kind, having kind schools uh, where we support one another, help one another when we need a helping hand, uh, makes our district a place where we all feel safe, welcome, and that we have belonging. So we encourage you, all to remember to focus on those acts of kindness. And don't forget to go onto our website and log those acts of kindness. We've recorded 30,000 acts thus far this year, and I believe we can get to 50,000 before the end of the year. And just imagine what these last weeks of school will be like if we have 20,000 additional acts of kindness spread across our schools and district and community. Just imagine how that will be. Thank you for all that you do, for your partnership, for your dedication in our shared effort to uh, create new opportunities and support every child in Santa Clara Unified School District. Have a great day.